Hey guys, it's Kez, and I'm starting a Minecraft Resident Rise 3 series. So, basically what the Yogg's cast are playing with right now. Before we get started, this is footage that I recorded while I prepared to start the new series, so what I'm doing, basically, is looking for a good starting point. I'm building a box to live in, and I'm giving myself a small kit of just some starting gear, so like stone tools, uh, that kind of thing. I wanted to release this video ahead of time to ask you for input and to see if you had any ideas where I could take this series, so... Yeah, keep in mind that on top of the main, uh, the new mainline pack, I also added some of the optional mods like the Twilight Forest to add more stuff and more places and more features and things like that. Um, I've also asked my husband if he'd be interested in joining, and he's open to the idea now that cursing is allowed on the show, and he feels he's more welcome to be himself, which is more offensive than I am. <laughs> so yeah, there's that. But no promises, because, eh, you know, he's busy, he works. So just assume that um, I'm going to be playing the series solo when you try to offer me ideas, so don't get your hopes up that I'm going to have a partner. <laughs> anyway, here are a couple of my ideas. First, I wanted to do something with some magic mods, and there's Psalmcraft, I think there's Ars Magica in this pack, I know there's Botania, uh, Blood Magic and Witchery are also in here, and I haven't really looked at most of them, but I have played with Ars Magica a lot, and I've played around a little bit with Botania. Just assume that I don't know very much, though, in general, because when it came to Ars Magic, I didn't get very far at all. Um, it's also kind of hard for me to pick just one and stick to it, so if you have a favorite magic mod pack or mod that you would like me to play with, let me know in the comments. Um, and then there's also the technological route. So there are mods like Forestry, Applied Energistics, Big Reactors, Ender.io, uh, Mechanism, all those mods. And they all lean towards um, manufacturing, industry, all that good stuff. Uh, they are also pretty compatible with each other. And one of the first things I want to build is a digital miner. So, I don't know, we'll see. Or I could just say balls to it and pursue both schools. So do both magic stuff and technological stuff. Uh, sorting system could be useful for sorting my magical stuff, for example. So, I don't know, it'd be helpful. Um, let me just look at my notes. I, co I could also just explore and see what there is to see, so exploring dungeons, visiting other dimensions, going to space, whatever. But if I do go for that route, it would be easier for me to do those things if I had the help of magic or technology anyway. So if I find a craggy biome, it wouldn't be so hard for me to check the thing out if I had a jetpack or flying magic. You know, just that kind of thing. Um, anyway. Those are just a couple of ideas. Let me know what you like. Uh, if you have your own ideas, go ahead and let me know, because I'd love to know what you all want to see. And I'm just about open to anything, so let me know. Anyway, thanks for watching the show. Hopefully I will be back to recording and editing and publishing in my old regular schedule soon. <laughs> I've had some trouble getting set up. Uh, the external hard drive that I backed up all my files to failed, so I actually don't have any of the saves from before I got my new computer. So it might be a little while before I'm all caught up on Dreadout, before I'm all caught up on Black and White, because I need to play those two games again, and I actually need to get a hold of another copy of Betrapped before I can even think about starting that series. And because Reflexive Arcade is no longer a thing, I would have to buy another copy, so there's that. Anyway. <laughs> I guess I'll just see you guys in the next video. Bye!